All right, everybody, welcome back to my channel. As you can see, it's been a while since I uh, released a tool review video. In front of me over here, I have a set of extremely nice ratchets. I stumbled upon this German brand. I saw it online and I was like, well, let me buy it. So I decided to buy this half inch one, which is Vera and Zyklop or Cyclop, whatever. So I decided I went and I bought this half inch. And once I got it, I could not believe this thing is extremely heavy. This is heavy duty stuff and uh, it works so, so good. I, after that, I was like, I gotta get the other stuff. So I went and I got the three eights as well. Three eights, right? All of them have this push to release socket thing. And then I got the quarter inch as well. I had to have it. Same thing, push to release. So I'm going to go over this. I'm going to do some measurements, dimensions as well, to actually show you what this is and, and, and what is it like to have it. So far, I've been using it about two and a half, three months. I have not had any problems. And uh, like I said, I'm a super, super happy. So I'm going to tell you actually what is good about these ratchets. And of course, there is one thing that I really, I'm not a fan of, but I'll point it just in case you guys are interested in buying this all right so first we're gonna do the half inch this is about 11 inches pretty heavy pittsburgh equivalent to that all right so this is a pittsburgh pretty heavy as well so let's do now three eighths the lengthwise it's about eight and a half inches it's almost a pound and equivalent to that this is the equivalent of a pittsburgh and as you can see it's a little bit longer so next is quarter inch the length five and a half inches pittsburgh which is right here it's almost identical but the advantage of pittsburgh is that it's longer the main difference between pittsburgh and vera is that the vera is way more sturdier it's it's more beefier right also the vera if you look at the head it's way smaller way thinner so it will fit in a tight spots look at that half inch that's massive right there and let's talk about the negative thing about this the problem for me is that this little thing here the problem is this thing is I'm afraid it's gonna snap you know I'm afraid that over time especially in this one I'm afraid it's gonna snap and this one as well so yeah that's uh pretty much what I wanted to show you guys with these uh, I really really love their tools uh, I'm in the process of buying their wrenches as well uh, little by little they have a couple of sets they have a metric and standard uh i'm really also into getting the sockets but the problem with sockets they only have a six point so far but yeah maybe in, in some near future they will have more options but yeah check them out i'm not sponsored by them but they're this this tools are great i mean they're kind of a little bit on the high side expensive but definitely worth it i love this this design uh it's it's heavy you feel it you definitely feel it and uh, the quality wise this is this is like a hammer <laughs> quality wise no no uh no complaints so far uh as well as they're they're like i said every single tool they have it looks really really good quality anyway of course um uh, if you're new consider subscribing like a share and uh i'll see you guys next time ladies